time for Nerdgasm. Hey, what's up, guys? Jerry here, aka Barnacles, and I'm here at PDX Land 27 in Portland, Oregon, which is a giant land party. And I'm attending with Puget Systems, you can probably tell from Master Beard <laughs> up there. And uh, I loaned him one of my 3D printers. This is the Ultimaker V2 Plus, which actually has an Olsen uh, hot end on it, the Olsen block hot end, and it has an upgraded extruder on it. And today, they're using it compared to their old original V2 to do some scanning of people and printing a bunch of little people like you can see here there's Beard Beardosaur again and uh, so they've offered to scan me in and I figured why not do a video you guys want to see what it takes to scan somebody into a 3D model and then print them out on one of these little guys all right so the first step in this process of digitizing me is they have to take a video of me from all around we've got some lights we got one big light up here we got another big light over here to cancel out as many shadows as possible and they're gonna create something called a point cloud afterwards which I'll show you but first I have to stand still right uh, yeah Wait, this is great. Jerry can't talk. He's got to hold still. All right. No. Oh, you're killing me, Tim. You're killing me. That's the same process that they used for making the 3D model of me to create the Stormtrooper suit that I wore at PAX Prime. So this is kind of cool. Let's see how this turns out on a little bit smaller scale. All right. So next step is we got to open the video on the supercomputer here. Which uh, can you tell? Can you tell us a little bit about that supercomputer right there? Yeah. So it has 64 cores. Uh, it only has 500 gigs of RAM right now. We can do two terabytes, but okay. it's like 35 grand for the RAM. Oh, only? Only. Only. Uh, but yeah. So 64 cores. We got two Titan Nexus in it, and then just like a standard SSD. So it's, it's really great for this stuff because this stuff has like needs tons of cores. Gotcha. So this is basically like William Senior we're dealing with right here. Okay. All right. So they started off with a video of me. Now they have to take a series of snapshots from that video. And then from the snapshots, they're gonna they're gonna create a cloud, and then from a cloud, they're gonna create a mesh. There's a whole lot of processing involved. That's why they need this gigormous computer over here that costs more than my car. So many pictures of Jerry in a skirt. So many. Man, I'm damn good looking in a skirt. So that's what I look like as some kind of ethereal being? I think so. All right, well, listen, can we make me a little more solid? We can make you a little more solid. All right, let's make me a little more solid. All right, we're putting a box around me. I'm sure a lot of people wish they could do that. One of these cores ain't like the other. One of these cores ain't like the other. Houston, Houston is a dick. <laughs> oh, that's starting to look like me. That's pretty crazy, guys. That literally just came from a little video. Look at that gut. That is magnificent. We can trim it. Nope. <laughs> no. No. I'm going into the danger zone now. Hold on. Hold on. Wait a second. You actually can see up my skirt. Yeah, there's nothing there. <laughs> it's like real life. Whoa. So he basically has to go through and find all the little points that are outside of my massively awesome body and delete them. But this is going to generate a mesh that's actually garbage. Then we're going to drag that into a CAD program and clean it up further because Matt likes to overcomplicate the hell out of everything. Processing. Processing. Processing more. Still processing. You're still watching. You haven't gone off to cat videos yet. Just admit it. You're too lazy. You're going to watch this. No matter what I show you, you are going to watch it. So just don't don't fight it. Hit the like button. All right. And subscribe. Like, 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 follow, subscribe. All right. I'm going to do something else now. It's working hard for its money. So hard for its money. Brought to you by Puget Systems and not AMD. All right. So this is my mesh. Didn't quite turn out as good as we thought, but I am confident that with hours and hours of labor that Matt can rectify this so I don't have to hold still again. I'm, I'm positive he can do it. We'll be okay. Yeah. He's just gonna, I'm just gonna have a big flat spot on my head now. Yeah. We're only printing it, like three inches high. You're so, never so, gonna so, know. So, so is that where my mom dropped me theoretically? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Thanks, mom. Oh. Oh. We can do it again. We wanna do the video again. Yeah, let's do the whole thing all over again. We'll just have to I'm just kidding. Yeah, it's like, no. <laughs> two hours, 12 minutes? That's not bad. Two, two hours, 12 minutes? All right, dude. Millimeter. All right, it's ready to go. All right, let's get it over to the printer.
guys, well, I would like to introduce you to many, many Barnacles right here who also has a micro Barnacles on his shoulder. Look at that. That's super, super tiny. So this little guy is awesome because he was printed in just about three hours. We used a higher speed, and because I couldn't hold very still in this crazy pose, it did come out a little bit lumpy, not as smooth as the other ones that they did. But still, it's an awesome demonstration that you can just take a bunch of pictures, 360 degrees around. You'd create something called a point cloud. Then from that, create a mesh, fix the mesh, then use G-Code to slice that mesh, send it to the 3D printer, and get any scaled size replica of that object you want. Not just humans. You could use it on cars. You could use it on other little items. You could use it to duplicate money and counterfeit it, and I don't know if you should probably do that. Somebody would have to be pretty blind to take that as real money. But anyways, you get my point. You can replicate just about anything. So we basically live in a time that's just like Star Trek, only nothing like Star Trek. But, but we're closer than we were like 10 years ago, so that's cool. All right, guys, well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a comment down below if you guys have any questions, or come over and follow me. I am at Barnacles, and also come over and follow me on Instagram. I'm at Barnacles there, and you will see a lot more pictures of this little guy all over PDX land. All right, guys, take it easy, and until next time. What's that, Micro Barnacles? What'd you say? What do you, what do you want me to do? Na 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 Getting a copyright strike Cause I'm humming music The Fine Brothers will probably say they own this Na 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 Na, okay I'm done Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please take a moment and subscribe to my channel. It helps me a lot. Also come over to Twitter. I'm at Barnacles. I'm a real social guy. Also if you have a couple of minutes, check out some of these many other videos. I made them myself. <laughs>